All right, this isn't my normal setup, but I, me and my dad went to the thrift store, and I just kind of want to show what I got. So the first thing that I'm about to show off is this GE Metal Sonic that I got for five dollars. This this plush can go to like thirty to fifty dollars, and I got it for five. Min bag, new, and yeah, let's just open it up. There's kind of like a hole right here. I don't know if they did that or the or like the shippers did that gave them, but let's open it up. I've been wanting this plush for a while. I've been interested in Sonic plush videos for oh, ever, and it's just kind of nice to see. You can check them out. It's nothing much. Um, let's move on. This is gonna be kind of a fast-paced reveal. I'm not kind of. I'm not gonna talk about stuff that much. Next we got is Wingnut. Um, he's in kind of a nice bag staple. He has a cool. He doesn't have any accessories. I wish he came with screw loose or some or something. But like, it's it's it is what it is. Um, here he is. He's got same articulation. He does kind of have the, um, I think it's plastic cancer, which is kind of common on wingnut figures, which is which is sad. It happens on a lot of vintage figures, especially like um, He-Man and Ninja Turtles. But yeah, that's about it, that one. Now we got um, this big thing that I don't know much about, but my dad said you need to get those and you'll thank me later. California Raisins. I got these for $10. I'm pretty sure this is the full set. We got um, this one. They're kind of bendy figures. I'm pretty sure they're also made by Big Moves, but I know that McDonald's came out some. We got this one. And then we got this one. And then we got this one. I don't assume anyone who watches my videos knows what the California reasons are, but if you do, um, good job. That's going to be the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed. Um, like, subscribe, and bye.